The attack on your brother and Gloria has put all this in motion. We're at war here. Walter must really believe those Serbs put the hit on Vic. I'm going to be putting together a war room. We don't have the manpower for that kind of shit show. You're either with us or you're against us. I need an army. It's going to cost you. I'm ready to take back what's mine. What you want? I got you. Anything I should know about? What's up, YouTube? It's your boy, Mark Dark, and I'm back with another video. If you're new, if you love power, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Like the video and leave your theories, comments, everything down below. Now, today we're going to be talking about Power Book for Force, Season 1, Episode 9, and we will be going over the description for Episode 9. I finally put it out a few days ago, so we're going to talk about it and break it down in this video. Now, you guys, make sure you check out my last Power video. I talked about your boy, Jannard, and the actor who plays Jannard, Chris Lofton, who is going to be in Episode 9 of Power Book for Force, and also... Episode 8 of Snowfall Season 5. So check that video out. Continue to keep yourself updated on all the latest news. And I will continue to give you guys these videos. But let's finally go over the description for this next upcoming episode. Now the title of the episode is called Trust. And the description of the episode reads, Vic faces a devastating loss. Walter is ready to go to war and sends for heavy hitters. Tommy soon realizes he needs more power but is turned down by one of his closest allies and is forced to turn to an unlikely resource. So those are the key elements of this next upcoming episode. And based off that description, I want you guys to let me know exactly what you think is going to happen in episode nine. It is supposed to be a fire episode. And since we have the description of this episode, I will go over the trailer once again, based off the new information that we do have. And as I told you in the What to Expect video, your boy Walter Flynn, he is ready for war. He wants to get back at the Serbians for what they did to Vic. And we know he doesn't like the Serbians. We already saw what he did to the Serbians a few episodes back. And of course, that has caused a ripple effect. The Serbians came back in the last episode and they sprayed up the spot. Your boy Vic is going to be pissed off. You know what I'm saying? Yes, that devastating loss is Gloria. She is not here anymore. And Vic is going to want revenge as well. He ain't going to be playing around. I mean, he loved Gloria. He loved her. I mean, just think about it. Gloria was getting her cheeks clapped by Tommy and he still didn't care. He said, you know what? I want to be with you no matter what. No matter what. So now we're going to see the aftermath after she is taken out, how this is really going to affect Vic. Now, I know some people still believe that this hit was not a Serbian hit. I told you guys, this was a Serbian hit. You know, I already broke it down. I talked about the twin already. This is, you know, 100% a Serbian hit. The twin wasn't playing around. He came and he tried to get revenge for his brother. So that's what you saw in the last episode. But your boy Walter Flynn will be putting his whole army together. And that's exactly what he is telling Claudia. He is trying to get her prepared. Not only just her. I mean, Vic, everybody needs to be ready for the Serbians in his eyes. You know what I'm saying? Because they are a huge threat to him and his organization. And he is tired of these issues, right? So that's what we want to see in this next upcoming episode. At the same time, we know Paulie doesn't really want to do this. Paulie is like, man, we ain't got enough heat. Like, is this really worth it, right? We know Paulie ain't trying to be going to war like this. At the same time, a lot of you guys have been saying that Paulie cannot be trusted, especially after some of the things that he's been doing, especially after what he pulled off in the last episode telling Vic about Tommy meeting up with Walter, but not telling Vic that Tommy said no. You know what I'm saying? Tommy did not agree with Walter Flynn. He doesn't want to be a part of the Flynn organization or whatever. And that's it. He is doing his own thing. So that whole move to tell Vic that information to me was a setup. He wanted to control the board and, you know, they wanted to make Vic act a certain way, in my opinion. But we do know your boy Walter Flynn will be calling some help. And the huge hitters is coming. And this is based on what we got in the description. He says that Walter Flynn is ready to go to war and he sends for heavy hitters. And these guys ain't going to be playing around. Now, Walter Flynn, he's been talking about the home country, Ireland or whatever. He's been talking about how these guys are not going to be playing around when it comes to family tradition and stuff like that. So let's see if they're going to be playing around when it comes to war. At the end of the day, it's going to be a lot of bodies getting dropped off. In episode 9. Now also in the trailer we see your boy Diamond get hemmed up. We don't know who is by but what we do know is Diamond probably needs to watch his back. 
He has a lot of people behind the scenes that's plotting and planning against him. And we already know who that is. Jannard, you know what I'm saying? So Diamond is going to be put in a sticky situation, in my opinion. Hopefully he is able to get out of it. And hopefully him and Tommy can be cool when it's all said and done. But based off what we are seeing in this description of this episode, this war is about to be crazy, y'all. And it seems like everybody's going to be going at it and... Only the strong is going to survive, right? Tommy will learn about what happened to Gloria. Remember, he told Vic to get out of town. He tried to save Vic. At the same time, we got Polly over there plotting and planning, trying to get Vic to go up against Tommy for real. So it's going to be a very, very interesting episode. We know in this trailer, we see Tommy having a conversation with the Serbians. I told you guys, based off what we saw in the trailer, Tommy is trying to make a deal with them. A lot of people say, why is Tommy making a deal with the Serbians? Well, based off the description, it states that Tommy soon realizes he needs more power, but is turned down by one of his closest allies and is forced to turn to an unlikely resource. So it seems like Tommy probably did go to one of his allies and try to get help and he was turned down. Something happened, right? So Tommy said, you know what? I guess I got to do a, you know, a deal with the Serbians. At the end of the day, Tommy is like, screw this. I got to do what I got to do to survive. I got, you know, the Flynn family probably coming after me. We got CBI. We got your boy Jannar plotting and planning coming after him. So he needs protection. And it seems like he can, you know, probably tell the Serbians like, look, I helped save you. When we had that deal to meet up to get back Liliana, I told you to look out because Jannar came and he sprayed up the spot, right? Now, Tommy never told them to get down and look out. Jannar would have had a better chance, a better possibility to end up hitting one of them, right? So he could tell them that. At the same time, we know Tommy, he is dealing with the new drug, Dahlia. That can be a future business opportunity for the Serbians. And, you know, maybe they can work together. But at the end of the day, we will find out more details once the episode airs. Now, we do know Jannar is coming. We talked about this in the What to Expect video. We know he's not playing around. He went to Cousin Buddy and he told him when he called him to be ready. So in the next episode, we can expect Jannar and the crew to get together, meet up with Cousin Buddy, and they will try to execute the game plan to eliminate Tommy. At the end of the day, they still need a 100% connect to the drug Dahlia, which Jannar, he doesn't even know where the resource is coming from. So maybe he finds out the information in the next episode. But what we do know is the war is coming. Bodies will be getting dropped off in episode nine. It's going to get very, very interesting. We're going to see if Jannar's game plan is going to work to actually get rid of Tommy, which at the end of the day, we know it's not going to work. It ain't going to work, man. You're not going to be able to get rid of Tommy. Most likely, you have a higher chance of getting popped. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully, Tommy continues to watch his back at all costs because they coming for him. They are coming for him and it's not looking good. We got Paulie and Walter Flynn plotting and planning. We got Jannard and, of course, his little crew and cousin Buddy. They all plotting and planning. Everybody's got a game plan. Everybody's getting their army together to go to war. At the same time, you know, the Jewish organization, they got hit up in the last episode. So I'm pretty sure they're going to want revenge as well. As the description stated, I told you guys, Tommy will be looking to turn to an unlikely resource, which we know is probably going to be the Serbians. I just hope Tommy and Diamond end up being cool when it's all said and done. I mean, based off the description, it is said that he is turned down by one of his closest allies and so far we know diamond and tommy they've been pretty cool so we're gonna see how it's all going to play out i mean the title of the episode is called trust and we know no one can be trusted and i got a feeling the people that tommy probably thought he can rely on they're gonna probably turn on him and it's gonna be a different outcome and that is just based on the description but you guys let me know man what do you think about the episode nine um description did it change any of y'all theories up for the next upcoming episode you guys let me know down below. Now, we'll continue to drop more Power Book 4 Force videos this week, so stay tuned. But thank you guys for all the love, all the support, and I will catch y'all on the next one. But let me get up on out of here, man. It's your boy, Mark Dark. I'm out. Peace.